You know, there's a lot that these Supreme employees and uh, 6 9 have in common. No, it's it's not that they're from New York. They're clowns. Oh, uh, I you mad about my 6 9 joke? I'm sorry. All I'm gonna say is, if you can't take it, don't put yourself in that kind of situation and don't front like it. But today, I'm here to talk to you all about some that happened today. Supreme employees backdooring the bikes, the Supreme Honda dirt bikes that were supposed to be in store only, but we got a whole story for y'all today. I mean, this is just classic Supreme move. I mean, I doubt the employees even care, but I know what these employees have been doing for the last few days. Hey, hey, don't tell boss. I'm, I'm just gonna, gonna do this. I'm only gonna take a little bit. I'm only gonna, I'm only gonna take a little bit. Don't, don't tell boss. Don't poke. Don't tell boss. Clown! You mad? I don't care. Basically, if y'all want more videos like this, please subscribe below and also drop a like. Uh, I'm not really gonna say too much other than drop a like in this video so we can get it out there more that these Supreme employees are clowns for what they did today. You, you overused that word, so I'm gonna stop talking about it, but you guys suck, and I'm about to assess why you guys suck. Now, I'm basically the messenger to make sure Father Jebia delivers his beating to all of you. Basically, here's what happens today. First little screenshot I'm gonna pop up. There was no bikes at the Supreme stores at all, not in any of the locations. I'll get into all that. I mean, here, I'll flip it to the locations. None of the Supreme bikes were there, and you want to know why none of them were there? Well, go back to the first image. They all got backdoor for $17,000 apiece. This dude even said his friend got two of them because he backdoored them with the Supreme employees. So, Supreme employees, f*** you. I don't know why y'all would do this, and I know some people are going to be like, oh, you have... You have no leeway to talk on this. You have no way to talk on this because you wouldn't even buy the bike. Are you buying the bike? If you aren't buying the bike, then you can stop talking right now. All right, enough of the sarcasm and all that. This It's really not that funny, but yeah, really right here, the Supreme employees backdoored all 85 of the Supreme Honda bikes for 17,000 a piece. And basically this has been proved. So Supreme employees claiming that they're friends and family only. And they basically just made some money today pocketing the bikes that Supreme made with Honda. And they didn't release them to the public because, well, they were already all gone from the store. They weren't even there. So, I mean, there was this guy here. Like, I'm going to flip to the next image. This dude was number one in line right here. And he was about to cop the bike. Probably make like 10K profit. About to make some bank. A lot of money. Uh, and basically, he didn't get any of them. And the reason he didn't get a single one is because they got backdoored before the drop even happened. So, basically, Supreme employees just took that little money that they got like this right here said don't tell mr jebia but oh mr jebia is about to know you all are dead i doubt you guys care though because you're skaters right you guys don't get scared of stuff right no okay sorry for making fun of skaters i know that's the culture of supreme and i'm sorry that's that's not what it's looking like no more with this this hype beast that they pulled today yeah that, that's really part of the culture guys really 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 showing love to the people who pay your salary support you really great move guys Good job. Here's the thumbs up. But yeah, basically, uh, they said they weren't going to be released to the public. They were friends and family only. But there's people saying, oh, yeah, I got I, I got one. Yeah, I uh, I backdoored them. What does that mean exactly? Oh, yeah, basically before the drop even happened, I, you know, hit some of the Supreme employees enough, you know, offered them a little bit more money. They got some of the cash, you know, they keep it. They get me a Supreme, one of the Supreme Honda bikes before it even drops. <laughs> Done. Deal made. So that happened today. And yeah, like here's something else here. All 85 of them got backdoored. Uh, there's proof of this too, because there was people posting on Instagram about this, like right at the time of the drop, like, how do you even have the bike already? Like, you're not even first in line. You weren't even there. How did you get it? Backdooring. So yeah, look, here's something also. This guy was the guy, I think I think this dude was number one in line, if I'm correct, uh, or someone else was, but this guy had some information. One of his friends or someone was number one in line. They didn't get a single one because they all got backdoored before. And look, all Manhattan, Brooklyn, LA, all of them got backdoored. So nobody got a single Supreme Dirt Bike. So, I mean, didn't matter if you were number one in line or number 85 in line and you had a chance at the bike. Guess what? You had no chance at it whatsoever. They were never there. They were all gone before. And like, here, look, here's someone uh, right here. Like this guy was right there. Uh, and this guy said there was none in store. They said it was friends and family only. So claiming that it was a gifted item and it was gifted to different people that were maybe into Supreme or had close connections to James. No, that, that never happened. That's all lies. Uh, actually, they just yeeted people so hard. Like if you were number one in line and you, imagine this, all right? You're number one in line. You're probably about to make 10,000 plus and you get you get over like that. Imagine how mad you would be. Imagine how mad you would be. I know I would be raging a lot harder than I am in this video. And no, I can't afford to buy the bike, but I can still talk about it. If you're mad about it, you can come meet me in person and we can talk it out or not. Your choice. But yeah, all you Supreme employees, you guys are some I don't know why y'all would do this. This is just some, 
I mean, I know y'all are making a fine amount because y'all are skaters and all that, so you know, so in the videos, you know, you're doing all that, your employees, you're just fine. I know Supreme probably pays you, pays you all just fine. They're a billion dollar uh, corporation, I would say now. Yeah, look, none of them there. Where'd they all go? Oh, where, where'd they all, where, where'd all the bikes go? You, you know where the bike went? Oh yeah, we got backdoored. Good job, Supreme. Uh, especially for you guys letting this happen. You guys would just suck for this one, all right? I know I'm a customer, so I know people are gonna say, how can, oh, you bought stuff from them, you're supporting them, how are you gonna hate on them now? Just stop talking. But yeah, your boy's slightly heated on this, so I'm gonna chill out, but... I mean, they, they, the retail was 10K, they got backdoored for 17K, now they're probably gonna be selling for way more since they never even dropped, even though they were advertised. Like, that's even worse, they advertised them and they never dropped. Never dropped. Never dropped equals backdoor. I'm gonna end it here. Subscribe if you guys want more videos of me hating on Supreme or just discussing anything with fashion. Usually I'm not this heated, but if you guys want me to be like this in videos, let me know and I can do this very easily because I can act like this all the time. So hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe, like, you Supreme employees, and peace out.